The semi-final begins. Poland taking on Germany for a such drama in the quarter-final stage for both of these nations. Poland, a 3-2 win against Serbia. And the gentleman who, well, that's a great chance, just suddenly came out of nowhere. Oh, no wonder Paris Brunner just brings his hands over his mouth. Last gasp winner against uh, Serbia from Filiborecic. And uh, a good stop made by uh, Bjekutovski. expected early pressure on the poles he's done well good little ball to Boris Boris with an option out wide instead just thumped it comfortable winning all three matches 10 goals scored just one concedes in their group a good chance for the pullback and poked in a beautiful finish clever play from Daniel Mikowajewski it's Poland 1 Germany nil. the player who came on as a substitute against Serbia and scored was put into the starting 11 today and that is why he has justified the faith shown in him by Martin Wodarski lovely pass from Rejcik the pullback also was very good several players playing their part in a stylish move Volski Another useful contribution from the Lech Poznan player. Flag surely will go up. Well, that's going to be a German player picking it up first and foremost, but difficult for Eric da Silva Moreira to control. Consecutive championships, five of them in a row. The height of their powers that just uh, evaded one, came to another, and then came to a third. Well saved by Max Schmidt. More steps. Comfortable for Jakutowski. Every minute. A little flick was a decent idea. Oh my goodness, that's come through to him. Miko Wajewski, who had a tremendous opportunity unexpectedly. From distance and nearly, nearly finding its way in, I think there was a German touch on the way. Wolski, yes, it's Tavis. With Raugo. Plays it to Brunner. Dangerous position and maybe not the right ball. Oh, we had teammates in front of goal who were really fuming about that. Scored on his debut against Bonner. Very, very risky from Poland. Wolikowski. Senior football in. Oh, it's an excellent chance and a great header. Max Moisted gets his first goal of this competition. A wonderful lead by the Hoffenheim player. He had a lot of space, but still, there was an awful lot required from that header. And it was an excellent one. Poland won, Germany won. Beautiful direction on the ball. Curved away from Piekutowski this game did get some goals in qualification turns and goes close and one back by Krzyzewski Krzyzewski's ball finds uh, Mikoyevski Boris what a lovely goal again from Poland. That's their second exquisite piece of football. These young players understand the game. They understand each other and they understand how to play big matches. It's Poland 2, Germany 1. It's Karol Boris's third goal of the competition.
very stylish football. What a pleasure it is to watch. Such awareness from Mikoyevsky. Hasn't he made a statement since being brought into the starting lineup after that great display as a sub again? Another example of very tidy interplay from Poland, albeit without the quality of finish on this against Portugal in their first game. 3 1 against France. That's a neat little layoff by Moerstedt. A shot from Herrmann, rather tame. Well, the goalkeeper was pressurised by Brunner. Relieved to see it go over the top. Really nice ball. Now Bodis is in some space and in the end it was hit from long. An opportunity for Germany right on the stroke of Huguera Kabar. Was he fouled? Not uh, in the judgment of Michal Obsenash, who blows for half time at the end of a tremendously entertaining 45 minutes of football in Hungary. We begin the second half as Poland lead at Germany by two goals. A little space for Davik. And touch from Charlotte does not stop the attack. It's Brunner, and that time Charles Herman Monera. Yet to score a competitive goal for the well controlled, beautifully controlled. What a oh, it's off the bar. And now surely to follow up and put it in off the post. Oh, that's remarkable. Moisted at the heart of it all. He laid it off to Darvik, who seemed to have beaten the goalkeeper. But he couldn't beat the frame. Moneda, excellent ball and in. Wonderful quality again from Eric da Silva Moreira. Such an outstanding free kick that from the number 17 the Zampaoli player as Germany have levelled the contest no chance at all for Piekutowski and after taking place on Friday now space suddenly out of nowhere and then rather misplaced to put it gently Telan Bulut, the player who got back to cover. Berjanovski coming on. Davi. Excellent ball. Hermann. Space. Beautiful goal. Germany 3 2 ahead. Having trailed twice. That was a wonderful finish from Charles Hermann. The Borussia Dortmund player has put Germany closer to the place that they desperately crave in the final of the tournament. A simple quality pass from Darvik and this was clinical from Hermann. Controls it, shapes for the shots and finishes wonderfully. German players know Mike Huras extremely well but they know they're in control of this game now as falling and striking Max Moerstedt couldn't get it beyond Piekutowski nonetheless Poland still with opportunities my goodness Filip Wolski, 3 all. this sensational game gives more and more and more. It is a beautiful advertisement for this competition. An outstanding goal by Filip Wolski. Max Schmidt was light years away from stopping that ball. There was 
with this corner kick for a Poland team determined to get back in front. The header was a soft one from Jakub Krzyzanowski. Or oh, free header. All oh, too easy for Germany. They go 4-3 up. Hassan Wedraugo, the 15-year-old, the youngest player in the team, makes it 4-3. Three headed goals for the Germans. It was a good jump. Clever from Brunner, trying to get away from Schala, who's been difficult to get away from. That time, Schala just misses a step. Brunner plays it to Davich, and it's going to be put in. It is a fifth goal for the Germans. The substitute, Robert Ramzak. 5-3, and now Christian Wurk's team is very close to a place in the final on Friday. So rarely has Paris Brunner been able to skip beyond Dominic Schala. He did that time. Darwin had lots of space and made the right decision. It was sensible play from the captain. He looked around, knew that the option was there in Robert Rapp. The Polish defenders really had to commit forwards at Brunner. He's felt the positive atmosphere in the Polish team and from the coaches as that clatters the bar from Hermann who nearly nearly had his second who read it well Hermann not a bad idea try and take this free kick for Poland and he fashioned something out of nothing very nearly he's had his moment of drama in this tournament scoring the 89th minute winning goal against Serbia the a sensational game and a wonderful win for Germany who have made the final of the UEFA under 17 championship in Hungary the Polish players were beaten but they were not defeated this was a noble display from some excellent young athletes in the end Germany finished beautifully